Welcome everybody, it's Rusty Money here on PlayStation Network and Rusty Money Gaming on YouTube. We are here on FS22. Gonna play some, yeah, gonna play some FS22. We're gonna load into multiplayer. Um, We're gonna go to my favorite game save right now one of my favorites we're gonna go over here to calm lands how about that we will load in come see I gotta check something do to do do to do, do do okay we're all good. We'll continue and start. Welcome everybody. How are we doing tonight? We're loading into Calm Lands here on FS22. Calm Lands is by Urshaba. We'll be doing the 200 horsepower challenge and look at that. 100% loaded. All right. We can get a busy Second Chance Ranch. Hello, Rusty. Hope you had a great day. Not too bad, Second Chance Ranch. Not too bad. All right. We have got to uh, do a couple of things to get <laughs> kind of finished reset back to where we were. Um, so, first off, what we need to do is let's just jump to our machines we need this machine here we're gonna go put this one back in the shed down at the farm we don't need it right now Eric D, welcome my friend. How are you doing? Thanks for stopping by the live stream here. I kind of got this almost all reset, so I thought I'd just uh, bring you all in here and do the last little bit to reset this from when I thought I lost it all. <laughs> So we do have to reduce the money back down to uh, 16,600. I'm good, Rusty. How are you, my friend? I'm not too bad, Eric. Not too bad. Actually, we can get this guy on... I think that field needs fertilized. Let's check it. Oh, it could use fertilizer. Okay. CBW Farms just became a sponsor. <laughs> CBW Farms is lurking. <laughs> Thanks, Chad. <laughs> Appreciate the support to the channel, my friend. That's awesome. We'll make a couple. We'll make a couple. We'll make an announcement. Well, we'll make a couple announcements once everybody. Once we get more people in here. So don't be afraid to share the live stream, everybody, or even in discord in the barn house chat uh tell everybody rusty's live because <laughs> nobody knows i was gonna go live N not even tobo <laughs> he doesn't even know i was gonna go live all right now let's 
get back to this here. I want, we need to finish picking up the straw. Oops. It looks like we need to reposition that. Actually, you know what? Let's, um... Let's drop that there. And let's detach that. Um, I don't think we're going to need that, I don't think. We do need to drop that money down. I think I have all the equipment repurchased. So everybody, if you're not aware, um, a couple of live streams ago, um, I was live streaming and in the live stream we talked about three or four different mods and I had installed those mods and activated them and we loaded back into the map everything went well exited the map and uh, after the live stream and you know saved it exited and then went to come back on the map a couple of hours later off camera and it would only load to 85 percent well long story short um, I have figured out the conflict and so stay tuned everybody tomorrow morning there'll be a video coming out showing you all the conflict and informing the community um, let's drop that um, put that there And so, um, in the midst of trying to figure that out, everybody, <laughs> I, um, yeah, had to basically sell everything to figure it out. So I used Comlands Bank to repurchase stuff, and, um, get the equipment back in here all right now we can um, do some pickup of straw we need to do that um, I don't think Let's just look here a second. I didn't have any equipment there. Do I got any still sitting at the store? Um, I don't think I have anything still sitting here. Okay, and then... Let's fly over here to the sawmill for a second. I don't think that I had anything going on over here. The one thing I did switch, everybody, since I had that issue, I took the time and sold the truck and what was on the truck and repositioned the decorative truck over there instead of it sticking out here so I have more room to turn around, which I talked about doing several times. And, okay, I got those two vehicles back. I got my Elo Tether back. I got a weight sitting there. I got my two cultivators back. I got the loader, the bag lifter, the blade back. Uh, the forage harvester is sitting in there. I got it back. I got the... Um, uh, header and uh, header trailer back. I got the plow back. I got a weight there. I got those two tractors back. I got the tree harvester back. I don't know if I must have forgot I already had a weight. So I got a couple extra weights that looks like that I don't need. 
Um, I got the corn header, the mower, the spreader, the truck, that planter. I got this multi fruit planter, the harvester, that little cedar, our water tank, the auger wagon. I got those two uh, grain tippers back, that silage wagon back, the log trailer back. Um, I got the auto load trailer back. I think that is all the equipment, so now I think we're safe to go ahead. Oh, sorry guys, um, concentrating a little bit. Ronnie, <laughs> good afternoon. <laughs> How about good night, Ronnie? <laughs> Five dollar tip from Ronnie. Hi, Rusty, how are you doing tonight? A uh, $2 tip from Lonnie. Well, thanks, guys. You're awesome. So, thank you to Ronnie and to Lonnie. Appreciate the support, guys, very much. Okay, so now we need go to I we'll need to go to um, transfer transfer to Comlands Bank okay so we can transfer a hundred thousand right now transfer that okay and then we can go two four what um then we can go let's get this to zero want that to zero okay then we can transfer one, two, three, four, transfer that give me the eighteen thousand. Okay, and so I need to subtract off there, put down another two, transfer. Sweet. Okay. Um John Brock, welcome my friend. Okay, that's good enough. We're down to 16,000. So that is where I believe we were. Uh, the la end of the last live stream, you all would have saw. So we should be all square, other than the fact that my equipment's all brand new. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the way, it, that's just the way it's going to be. Tomorrow morning, everybody, for those watching, you will see what the conflict is. You will see what the conflict is. There will be a video released tomorrow morning. Alright, we need to go down this here. I kind of estimated a little wrong. get this loaded we need to put the straw on the fermenting silo and let it ferment to silage which right now I think we got some chaff in this fermenting silo that's fermenting to silage so we're gonna have a nice uh, stockpile of product okay now we should be able to then reposition here and get this back to work in the way I want it to work okay so let's whoops um, okay yep we'll lower that there okay 
There's potential it's going to pick up two of them at once, but I don't think it's going to do it every time. That's what we can hope for. Oh, we're full. All right, let's detach the front. New case come out tomorrow. New case come out tomorrow. Really? What's that? Like modded or or what? What have I missed? <laughs> Lonnie, what have I missed? Cuz everything that I've done um FS wise um I have been playing, well I shouldn't say really playing, I've been testing. <laughs> testing, trying to narrow down the conflict, and I believe that I got it narrowed down. I had it narrowed down to two, I thought two mods were conflicting with each other, but I got it narrowed down to one, so yeah, you'll see the video in the morning. The new big cases. Okay, the new big cases. Okay, I don't know nothing about them, I guess. 715 horsepower. Well, geez, Ronnie, you don't need that more horsepower. You already usually have enough. What do you need 715 for? David, welcome, my friend. How are you doing? Steiger. All right, sounds good. All right, let's check that production. Why that finishes loading? We'll show you what we got here um, in production. Right now, the chaff silage is activated, and um, we have uh, 304,000 liters of straw. <laughs> 306,000 liters of straw available to ferment. So, yeah, our fermenting silo is sitting really good with the uh, uh, product there. We still got um, uh, quite a bit of wood, 37,000 liters of wood producing the firewood, and we've got uh, um, 88,000 liters of wood producing the planks. We do have some dry corn we need to pull out of that and get that put in the silo. Artemis, welcome my friend. How are you doing buddy? Thanks for stopping by the live stream here. Appreciate it. We're just here on the old 200 horsepower challenge here on Calmlands. Thank you to everybody that gave the suggestions that how to potentially help uh, save this game save. <laughs> when I ran into the issue of it only loading to 85%. So do appreciate everybody's input. And the one suggestion I believe came from Gaming Joy, which was to shut off all equipment mods and try and load in here and so I shut off all the equipment mods and it successfully loaded so everything that was not a placeable such as a production point or a sell point or a decoration I shut off and I got the game saved to load again so then once I did that I automatically <laughs> saved it and also updated the game files for FS22 in my PlayStation iCloud so if it happens again or something goes wrong it will at least take us back to this point JC Farms Outlaw Custom Mag and Brandon welcome my friends how are you doing 
Let's get that put back down. Let's now start picking up some more straw. Doing great. Cascadia Gamer, welcome, my friend. How are you doing, buddy? Thanks for stopping by the live stream here. Hope everyone is having a great night. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. I got my mod conflict video recorded, edited, sent to YouTube. Um, I ran down the subway while it was rendering to YouTube and um, grabbed me a sandwich, came home, ate such sandwich, and then decided I'm going to go live for a little bit before I go to bed. Got the new internet router today and went to stream and Streamlabs would not open so I had to reinstall Streamlabs. Oh no! Well, hopefully you got it all fixed now there, Outlaw. I know I don't have access to this land. <laughs> got everything ready for tomorrow well sweet and I'll be at work when you're probably live streaming which that really is no fun <laughs> I'd rather be playing the game and watching you live stream outlaw instead of having to be at work but that's okay guess we all got to do something you know I do get sat Sunday off, and most of Saturday, I guess, so that's not too bad. Um, let's uh, raise that, shut that off, let's detach that. We need to go put this in the silo. I have my 200 horsepower challenge on hold right now is when I sold my auto watering mod for the greenhouse it sold the 1 million liters of water it had for 209 million. Since I'm on console I'm figuring out the best way to remove the money. Cascadia, what you could always do to remove the money is do what I did here. So load your game save into multiplayer, Cascadia. Um, load your game save into multiplayer, and you could move the money all to what what position. So, like here, I can transfer transfer Rusty's money to the bank. You could transfer. I mean, well, that might not... Well, I don't know if that would work or not. You could set up a second farm in multiplayer mode, then move all the money, or you could use, like Ronnie said, lay down the start from zero mod a couple of different ways. Because if you load into multiplayer Cascadia, you can always load back into career mode. But yeah, I'd, I'd, I'd maybe use what Ronnie suggested in there. Just use the start from zero mod and you can decrease by, you know, you could de decrease that way by at least 100,000 anyway, which would save from leasing and returning a lot of things. Or you could decrease by 500,000 and then 100,000 after that. Alright, 
Let's deposit some more straw in here. So welcome everybody to Rusty Money's live barn house chat with everybody here watching. And welcome to my version of the 200 horsepower challenge that was created by Crustu on YouTube and shared in different social media um, groups or servers or channels or whatever you want to call them all. <laughs> Because it's in Discord, it's on Facebook, it's on YouTube. But I had I had to come back on here and live stream just because of the fact that we were able to save it. I'll show you all we saved it. Howdy, Rusty, and hey everyone, Northern Farm Sim, welcome. I was thinking about doing. The start from scratch mod just was hoping I wouldn't have to buy 209 one liters of stone. I need a bail so I can I need a bail so I can sit down long day and I'm tired. <laughs> well, I sure hope you get some rest, JC. I appreciate you, buddy, for stopping by the live stream. Just just remember what I always say, JC. Make sure you can go find yourself a couple of donuts. You know, donuts give those cops energy. That's why they call them batteries. You know, cops call donuts cop batteries, everybody. Well, at least that's kind of the joke that was always here in the Midwest, anyway. So don't forget about those batteries you can always go try. I might give you a little extra oomph to your giddy up. <laughs> Jack Sarge Farman, welcome my friend. How are you doing, Jack? Thanks for stopping by the late night live stream here on Calm Lands. We saved it, Jack. I saved the game save. I figured out the issue. There will be a video out in the early morning hours tomorrow morning, everybody, about the issue. I'd tell you about the issue, but I don't want to ruin the video, so, hey, you will see it in the morning. Well, hopefully, you all get something out of it, because it really, it really, um, yeah, the issue I discovered really gives me a different, uh, thought process when it comes to figuring out other issues we may encounter later in FS. <laughs> I'm glad you're able to rescue the save. Well, I know, Jack, what really helped rescue the save, because I didn't even think about it, was a simple comment in the chat by, I believe it was Gaming Joy, in that live stream I did on on uh, Split Mountain Ranch last was he suggested I shut off all the equipment mods so basically shut off all the mods except for my placeables such as the decoration mods my cell points and production points and see if it would load in and I got lucky and it loaded in so then I saved it, and uh, then I immediately updated my files files on my PlayStation to my PlayStation iCloud for FS22. So if it happens again, or I run into an issue, at least I can come back to that point 
and I'm going to try and continue to occasionally update those files in the iCloud just in case uh, Julia welcome my friend how are you doing and then there's a special thank you also in the video tomorrow that you all will see um, as well. Let's see. Let's uh, raise that there. Stop that. Detach. We'll go throw this in the fermenting silo lurking while at the gym all right julia on xbox all my save are always done in the cloud automatically uh, there's probably a way i can do it too cascadia i just never have really messed with it i guess Nineteen awesome people checking out the live stream. Appreciate each and every one of you. We're just finishing up a uh, picking up straw after that harvest we did, and then we need to roll on into October. Chad from CBW Farms. There he is, everybody. Thanks for becoming a sponsor, Chad. Appreciate the support to the channel. So now that we know that Mr. Chad is here... Thank you, for becoming a sponsor my friend a member of the channel according to the old stream elements bot so how's everybody doing on this late night Thursday night I'm not doing too bad myself Laugh out loud, I saw that. Today must have been renewal day. Sorry, but it was automatic. <laughs> it's okay, Chad. No worries, my friend. Appreciate it, though. How is... Oh, and look at there, everybody. Well, how about that, JC? Hopefully you're still there trying to find that bale to sit on. <laughs> well, how about that? Thank you again. To you, our friend Ronnie, for gifting that membership to you. Um, our other friend, J.C. Farms. So, J.C. Farms just became a member of the channel with a little gifted membership by our friend, Ronnie. Appreciate the continued support, Ronnie, as always. Thank you very much, my friend. Jody, welcome. How are you doing, Jody? Thanks for stopping by the live stream. Twenty two awesome people here. Thank you very much for being a part of the Barnhouse chat here on Rusty Money Gaming here on Comlands in my version of the two hundred horsepower challenge. 
A really good day. How about you? Not too bad, Jody. Not too bad. It was pretty busy in the old agricultural parts world <laughs> at the dealership today. But, yeah, it just makes the day fly by, though. That's the good thing. I guess makes the day go faster when you're busy. Sold some hydraulic uh, filters for an MX, uh, what was it, an MX240, I think. Um, what else did I look up today? I looked up a front and rear auger to bottom auger of the inside of the grain tank on a 5140 case harvester and then the bearings for both sides of such front and rear augers inside the bottom of the grain tank also had to um, look up the uh, rivets that are on the uh, unloading tube. Oops, could have cra probably grabbed that one. Also probably looking into parts for sprayers as well. <laughs> Actually, uh, Cascadia, we don't we don't deal with uh, sprayer equipment um, we don't sell basically we don't have anything for sprayer parts including case sprayer parts even we don't get into that at all um, we refer them to a different dealership in a different community not far from us really Looked up some Bobcat stuff today. I'm trying to think what exactly. Because I look up so many parts every day. Looked up a lot of stuff for 5140 Combine today. The ones I already said were just a few of them. Tried to find a cross reference filter for a Cub Cadet riding lawnmower. Because we sell all kinds of parts, everybody. <laughs> the dealership I work for has all kinds of licensing to sell all kinds of stuff. So I uh, deal with a lot of different kinds of parts every day made uh, made a new hose for a grapple for a farmer um, I'm not sure you know what tractor or anything he has that on but um, and then made two other so I made three hoses today three new hoses hydraulic hoses I looked for all the battery cables on a 966 old uh, case age international tractor they're pre-made even though we will make we do make our own battery cables as well which I don't really care for doing because it's a pain it's not real difficult it's just I've only done it once so far so <laughs> I don't make them nice and neat like somebody that's made several of them already dust bunny welcome how are you doing tonight dust bunny Again, everybody, 
to anybody new watching we're back here on calm lands as you can see I got the mod conflict issue fixed figured out and there is a video being released tomorrow morning I was hesitant on creating the video but I reached out to a really dear friend of the channel to get some very respectable thoughts from somebody very well known in the community and it was pretty much um, yeah get her done type thing so you'll see the video out tomorrow morning all right now let's uh a little bit sore laugh out loud my daughter-in-law and i put primer on my tiny house ceiling yesterday and did yard work today <laughs> Gonna paint the ceiling tomorrow afternoon. Oh, ho, ho. well, looks like things are taking shape there, Dust Bunny. All right, now we need to park the old, uh, put the old forage wagon somewhere out of the way. Let's go ahead and give this a nice so uh, wash off. There we go. Let's get the tractor a little bit here. I don't know if I can reach the front. Yeah, we're going to be able to reach the front windrow or two. Give it a little shiny. Alright, that's good. That way if Argzy's watching later he'll see that we actually cleaned our stuff I found muscles I didn't know I had going up and down the ladder and I'm painting all the way around 704 square feet of edging <laughs> So, Dust Bunny, is your uh, new tiny house, is it like like tiny house style, like the fancy looking tiny houses you see on those shows on TV? I can't, you know, called tiny house, I think. Let's put that over there I've always found them kind of interesting but I want to I don't think I'd be able to live in one unless I was of course you know by myself but I still don't think I could live in one <laughs> oh what am I doing I want to now fertilize we need to fertilize that field and another field quick I totally left there without um, the fertilizer spreader, but we need to move this. Let's move this auger wagon here. Out of the way, just in the grass here for right now. We'll grab the spreader. And we will go spread some fertilizer on those two fields real fast. See what we got for fertilizer. Okay, we got enough fertilizer. That should be enough. And now I get to repeat it all tomorrow. Laugh out loud. No, sir. It just looks like a house someone put in a dryer and shrunk. Has a bathroom, bedroom, closet, kitchen, and front room combo. Oh, okay. Cool. Cool. 
Let's go fertilize the furthest away field first, and then we'll come back down and get that other one. Then we'll go to sleep into uh, October. When it's done, I'll post some pics in Discord. Which chat room would I put pics in? Uh, share your pics. Share your photos is fine there, Dust Bunny. Share your photos can be pretty much anything you want to share, whether it doesn't just have to be game. Uh, it might be show pics or something like that. Can't think the exact title. Show pics or show photos, something, something like that. Anyway. Oh yeah, I got it. Whoops. Bumped the wrong button there. Forget I gotta unfold it. Okay, now we can spread fertilizer. There we go. Holy cow, is that really all the faster we go? <laughs> All the faster we go, we go. <laughs> so, possibly live stream Friday night, everybody. We will see. I'm not sure yet. Um, hopefully, live stream Saturday. And uh, Sunday. I just don't know what times really yet. I'm not sure when Mrs. Money's working as well. What time is it getting to be here in real life? 10.30? Okay. Hmm, I have a hunch. I feel like I can go faster. I feel like if I use that. No, 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 no. Tobo Fish, welcome, my friend. How are you doing, buddy? Thanks for stopping by the live stream. Good night, Ronnie. We'll see you later, my friend. Have a good one. Thanks for the tip and the gifted membership. The gifted membership by Ronnie went to JC Farms. Yeah, so I don't know if I missed it in the chat, everybody, but for those that have looked at the two new maps that came out in the Mod Hub today, um, how are those two new maps? Will you and Mr. Rusty be playing FS together again this weekend? Hopefully, Dust Bunny. I am Rusty, just got done playing Call of Duty. <laughs> Man, seems like we're going really slow. <laughs> 
Just finished up the workout. Well, good deal, Juliet. Congratulations on finishing up another workout. I was doing pretty good last week going to the gym, and this week, because of the weather here, I guess that was my excuse. <laughs> I didn't want to leave the house because the town was a filthy mess with all the snow and ice everywhere, but now tomorrow I probably should go because a lot of it, most of it's all melted, so now it's just a wet, ooey gooey mud hole everywhere. So did you tell what the problem was with Calmlands or are you going to make a short video? Okay, Tobo. So here's the situation, everybody. Yeah, just getting back to things too after having that cough that just wouldn't go away. <laughs> yeah, that's that time of year too. <laughs> um... Well, everybody, what, a couple of live streams ago, um, during the live stream, we ended up uh, installing uh, four new mods during that live stream. And to speed up the uh, description here, um, none of those four mods were the issue, everybody. Um, although, what I will say is, um, thanks to Gaming Joy, I believe it was him in the live stream on Split Mountain Ranch that made the suggestion to shut off all the equipment mods. So I shut off every mod that I had on here except for productions, cell points, decorations, those kinds of mods. And the game save loaded 100%. So once it did that, um, I, uh, I, um, immediately updated my uh, iCloud because the iCloud for FS22 hadn't been updated for a little while on my PlayStation. And then I took the suggestions um, after that by installing groups of five mods at a time, the equipment mods then. And I started by repurchasing all of my equipment. I did, Gaming Joy, thanks to you. Ivan, welcome, my friend. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing your name right or Ivano. Um, appreciate you stopping by the live stream. But, um, so, yeah, I started to repurchase all the equipment and, um, got all the equipment repurchased, everybody. And it loaded to 100%. And from there, I will say no more. <laughs> Because there is a video coming out tomorrow morning, everybody, and uh, you will learn the rest of what was discovered. But it's all working. It will continue to work now as long as I operate things um, the way... In the way where it doesn't cause the conflict. How about that? A 
we'll leave it at that. So, Game Enjoy, thanks for the suggestion of shutting off all the equipment mods. That's what initially helped save the game save. So I shut everything off, but the my placeables pretty much. The productions, the sell points, the decorations I had here. Looking forward to the rest of the story tomorrow. It's a uh, quite interesting gaming joint. And I'm sure you will probably be one of the very first to uh, let me know more. <laughs> After you see the video. As the world turns, love a good mystery. Thanks, Dust Bunny. Alright, Ronnie, we'll see you later, my friend. Get some sleep. That's what we're going to do here soon, too. We'll see how work goes tomorrow, everybody, if we live stream tomorrow night. But that's kind of my plan. Ooh, I already, already fertilized that. Okay. We don't need to fertilize that one. But if I do decide that I'm not too tired and we can live stream, um, I might put up a poll to see where we live stream. Alright, let's put the old spreader back in the shed, and then we're going to roll into the next day. Good night, y'all. See y'all next time. Alright, JC. Thanks for stopping by the live stream, JC. Appreciate the support to the channel, my friend. Okay, let's put the old tractor in the shed here. Alright, well, it is time to go to sleep and get into October, everybody. See what we can get into in October. Suppose we should technically put the bed down, huh? What is October going to bring us? Hey, we got a field that's ready to harvest. Our sorghum field right there. Andrew, my friend, welcome. Great demand at forage cell point. I bet our firewood is full again. Maybe our firewood isn't activated. Let's see what's going on here. We got some wood planks. Mm, we need to move that cor dry corn. Firewood is full. Let's shut that off for now. 161,000 liters of silage right now we do have. 
Okay. There are sometimes I wish there was a better way to contact map authors. Messing around on a random map. Found a few bugs that are super easy to fix. Wish I could help the community by fixing it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, gaming joy. Hit. Hmm. What about... Um, what do I want to do here first? I want to lose some of that dry corn. Let's use the truck here. Maybe you have gaming joy, but have you made a map or a map? <laughs> oh. Can't talk. <laughs> what about a video? Or did you talk about some of those in your video in one of your episodes? I agree, Game Enjoy. I think all map maker and modders would put some sort of contact leak in their descriptions. That's a great idea, Dust Bunny. Of course, I know the they probably would get a lot of wasted messages. Well, yeah, I could see that too, Dust Bunny. I could see that too. Um, I wasn't well I wanted to create a video I should say everybody and after I got to thinking about it I was very hesitant and almost decided to not do it but I reached out to one particular individual only one and you will find that out on the video and that individual um, was very receptive um, alright, we need to load here. I think this is the load point. Yep. Alright, let's go now. I will tell you all that I wanted to try and make the video short. I wanted to try and make it really short, but I'm kind of chatty, and I really wanted it to also not be, um, what do I want to say? Um, I also wanted it to be, um, in such fact that the mod was a, is a great mod, is what I'm trying to say, I guess. And I just wanted to very well describe everything that I did in order to come up with the, with the discovery. So it's a 30 minute video. So I mean it's still not really long but it was, it's longer than I was wanting. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna redo it. I'm gonna leave it the way it is. Uh, I'm going to put this in the silo for now. Uh, we have just a little bit more up there. Which I might just keep that up there. So I keep that in there for now. And let's put this in the shed then. Uh, I better shut it off so we don't run it out of gas. Okay, and then we're going to take the Alice. I just love this tractor, this modded tractor. 
I didn't use it much in 19 when it came out, but here in 22, I really enjoyed this one on this map. Now, when I did repurchase this, you can see that I repurchased it without the duels. Uh, but um, what I did put duels on is that little tractor there. How's everyone doing too? Otherwise, I didn't make any changes really, everybody, or any uh, additional equipment. Um, trying to think now. Oh, I know what I wanted to do. Well, how about that? Look at that, everybody. Our carrots are above ground. <laughs> carrots are looking pretty good here. Five gen, welcome, my friend. Um, I th the fear is to avoid the negative comments. Yeah. I agree with that, Game Enjoy. Yeah, it even kept the carrots, yeah. It did, and you know what? Um, I think I'd even shut... Well, I can't remember now, Gaming Joy, but I think I even shut those off when I was trying to rescue the save. So that is kind of cool that they're still there. Oh, I don't want to go down there. What am I doing? I don't want to go down there. I want to go up here. I'm really... Argz! <laughs> Argzy, my friend. <laughs> Welcome, buddy. Commander in chief is in the barn house. Chat, everybody. My old commander in chief. Argzy, there is a video coming out in T minus seven hours or so. Um, appreciate it if you take some attention to that video. I was able to save this game save, Argzy. I have uh, discovered a conflict with a mod. Or mods. And the video will be out tomorrow. Well, let that um, load that will load there and then um what i want to do is oops turn around rusty wrong way we need to get some water i need to replenish water here I don't know how much we'll actually need. We'll just fill it up. Alright, so that is uh, full. Okay, now we need to give the old uh, Crustus coffee. Crustu's coffee shop. <laughs> Crustu's coffee needs some water here. We'll refill that with water. That's all that mod takes is water, and then it produces coffee pods, pallets of coffee pods. Alright, now let's go give the old cows some water down here
replenish their water supply. Okay, so now I know that that's all been replenished for what I need to put water in. And I realize there's a new mod, everybody, for the whole water system. But for right now, I am uh, not utilizing it. Well, glad to hear you were able to save things. <laughs> yeah, yeah, me too. All right, now let's go sell some firewood. We'll go sell some firewood down here to our friend Jack. So let's go sell some firewood down to Jack's roadside stand. make some money off of this down there that will help hopefully we get about six thousand or so maybe more <laughs> argzy telling everybody hello Alright, ooh, and it looks like our, what did I put down here? I gotta remember, I think it was sunflowers maybe? Looks like the sunflower field is potentially ready to harvest down here too. The zombie, Zombex CR. The Zombex CR, hello bro. Well, hello the zombie. How are you my friend, or... However your username is pronounced. Appreciate you stopping in the live stream. Thanks for the support to the channel. Alright, let's uh, sell some firewood to our friend Jack Sarge Farming. Oh, that's awesome. Thanks, Jack. We just made $9,000. $9,040. Oh, yeah. Sunflower Field is ready to go. Ah, you're welcome, buddy. Glad to be doing business with you. All right, now we can go. We can go let this fill up some more, so we can turn towboat's firewood back on because towboat needs to get busy again, and make some more firewood. So as I progress here, everybody, I've been naming the production and/or sell points I can rename to other people that are doing this. 200 horsepower challenge so we got Krusty's coffee we got Jack's roadside stand we've got Murphy's sawmill we've got Dave's marketplace so all of those are for different YouTube creators for FS that uh, are doing this challenge as well so of course Crustu's Coffee is Crustu on YouTube, the creator of this challenge. And then uh, Towboat's Firewood, that of course is Towboat Fish, who also is working on this challenge a little bit, um, creating videos. And then we've got uh, Jack Sarge Farming who owns Jack's roadside stand here that we just sold to. And then we got our friend Farmer Murphy, who owns Murphy Sawmill. And then we got F.S. Dave, who owns Dave's Marketplace. And uh, then we've got Eric D, 
who is uh, the owner of Eric's Corn Dryer. I took some inspiration from this challenge in setting up Aussie No Man's, but gave myself a bit more of a HP limit considering <laughs> considering the size of the map. Cool, Argzy, that's cool. Okay, now. Now I think we can get Tobo back to work. Yep, Tobo can go back to work now. There we go, making firewood. Okay, so then. Let's go sell this a little bit. Mr. Rusty is an inspiration to us all. Well, thank you, Dust Bunny. I appreciate that very much. Sweet, more wood. <laughs> Kobe Gaiman, what's up, my friend? How are you doing, buddy? Thanks for stopping by the live stream, Kobe. Appreciate it. Again, everybody, for anybody possibly new lurking or watching, there's a video coming out in the early morning hours. So, like, T minus seven hours or so from now, which will be a very informative video about the mod conflict I had on this game save. Glad to see you back up and running. Thanks, Charles. Video coming out tomorrow morning, my friend. About that issue. Um, another $1,356 from Jack. Thanks, buddy. Alright, let's get on out of here. I think we should maybe sell some planks how about that everybody we need some money doesn't matter what map it is mr tobo fish is always doing something with trees and wood <laughs> oh that's 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 kind of uh, true in a number of ways, Dust Bunny, because not only does he like to to cut them down in the game, either why he's playing himself or watching me cut them down, he also likes to fall asleep and cut down trees while he's falling asleep too. <laughs> When he's trying to, when he's trying to watch Rusty Farm, he ends up falling asleep sometimes, because <laughs> he's got to go cut more wood. All right, we gotta get over here to this sawmill. Farmer Murphy sawmill. We gotta load up this wood planks. We're gonna go sell what's here, which I don't think there's a lot here, but I want 
to go ahead and get a little bit more money in the bank. In Rusty's account, anyway. I know that feeling. I've fallen asleep watching as well. No offense. It's just that I can't seem to stay... <laughs> Stay up late as I used to when I was... Oh, I understand, Dust Bunny. I understand totally, believe me. I get it. I find myself falling asleep just playing the game, so... Yeah. I'll even get on the game, you know, kind of in the early evening or afternoon I'll get on the game I'll be wide awake and about 20 minutes later after playing this relaxing game I get sleepy sometimes <laughs> and then I end up when I'm plowing a field I jump across to the next field or cut somewhere I shouldn't be cutting <laughs> okay I'm headed to bed everyone have a great night good to uh good to see everyone well good to see you too julia thanks for stopping by when i'm playing or fall asleep i usually end up in a river or some other body of water <laughs> i agree with that too dust bunny i know tobo has before <laughs> He fell in a big old river once. <laughs> on a map. <laughs> I'm normally doing circles. <laughs> Alright, let's get turned around here. Now that I readjusted these decorations a little bit, we got a little bit more room to turn around in here. All right, we better we better go see where we can sell this the best. Um, where can we sell our wood at? Wood planks the best. Wood planks. A sawmill actually. Okay. We can go there. We'll go there. Come on, yo, Alice. We should have went the other way. We could have went under the bridge. That's all right. We'll pull her this way. I just wanted to use the dutes, every, or the dutes. Oh my goodness, I can't talk. I just really wanted to use the Alice here, everybody. So, we could hook up the dutes and we'd go a, a little bit faster, but. I'm going to sell this up here at the sawmill. Get us some more money. Should take a look at what's in used sales since we moved into October into a new month. I try to, I guess. Laugh out loud, that's funny. <laughs> okay. While that is doing that, let's see what we got in here. Okay. Wow. There is a feed wagon and the used sales that might be useful if I was to switch to making some TMR
Uh, English, please, but welcome. Thanks for stopping by the live stream. I'm sure you're just saying hello or good morning. I don't know which, but... All right, we're going to sell this over here. We'll make a little bit of money here. Um, maybe the trigger's not there. There it is. All right, 28,140. Sweet. We'll take that. We're up to 50,000. All right, everybody. Kind of a shorter live stream, everybody, than usual. I would continue on till midnight, but I do got to work in the morning, and I want to make sure that I'm up in time to hopefully see some of your guys' comments after you see the video. I usually release videos at 7 a.m., everybody, but I am going to release the video at 6 a.m., so that way, I can see some of your comments before I go to work. <laughs> so, I do appreciate you all for being a part of tonight's live stream. So, if you haven't yet already, please drop me a tasty treat on that like button, which is better known by myself as a cop battery and by all you people as a delicious donut. Don't forget to leave us a comment in the comment section and please share a box of donuts with all our friends and family by sharing the videos and the live streams from the channel. But for myself, Rusty Money, we will see you all on the flip side, everybody. Have a good one. Thanks, Argzy. Thanks, Dust Bunny. Thanks, Tobo. Thanks, Eric D. Thanks, Gaming Joy. Thank you to um jc farms thank you ronnie and lonnie thank you northern farm sim thank you to john brock I'm trying to think who else was here <laughs> thanks uh, th thanks luke marshall luke marshall there either showing up late or lurking one of the two thanks buddy Appreciate it. All right, everybody. We will see you all later, everybody. I got to get some shut-eye. See you later. Have a good one.